Samara signing out with some more Dark Souls Remastered. Alright, so last time I did some surviving, basically. I found a lot of my best equipment, early on especially. But I got a Drake Sword, which is really useful. And I got a shield that increase that speeds up my stamina recovery greatly. I got this Boar Helm. I got a bunch of great gear last time. A little drawn out. I did a little tracking that I didn't need to, tracking I didn't need to do, but I think it worked out. Anyway, so is there something down there? I see that ledge, and now I'm wondering if there's an item I missed. Can't see. Okay, there's nothing. Is there nothing? If there was an illusionary wall, I think someone would have left a message or something. Okay, sorry, I just saw that ledge. Okay, anyways, but right now we are at near the top of the bell tower. And past this door is going to be our first major challenge. So, I've got nine Essence Flasks that should do. I got my Drake Sword. I feel pretty good. Let's give this a first whack. A lot of blood stains. That should tell you everything you need to know. Here it comes. It's alive! I gotta remember this thing's patterns, and I don't. All I remember is that if you cut off its tail, you get a cool axe, but I, it's not gonna beat my Drake Sword. Boom! Okay, Bell Gargoyle. Oh, that was close. sword does. Alright. Oh, I forgot. After you deal so much damage to this gargoyle, then another one shows up. But I feel pretty good. Oh, crap. Freaking Estus. I gotta get them separated. If I get caught in the fire and that one's range, it can be problematic. Come over here, man. Oh, right, they both use fire. Ah, oh, crap. If I just kill one. I'm putting myself in a corner, aren't I? Frank. There we go. Okay, one down. Uh oh. Jesus, that was close. Drink. Snuck by him. Okay. Okay, almost got this. Just bear with me. One more swing! Yes! Boom! Okay. That went pretty well for my first try. Between humanities, take a bow, good sir. There we go. Alright. I underestimated the power of my Drake Sword and of my own abilities. Uh huh. <laughs> that cockiness is gonna get me in trouble. You indeed did it, as did I. Alright, great. Is there anything around here? I don't think so. Nope. Saint. Oh yeah, that's right. There's gonna be somebody in here soon enough. Right, but now we climb up here. That went a lot smoother than I expected, honestly. I expected to come back like two, three times or something. But that went pretty well. That went pretty damn well. Things are going pretty smoothly while well, I say that, but it could get really rocky real fast, and I have a feeling this is going to be about the time after this 
it's not it's just gonna get harder first bell this is still the early stages this is the easy stuff but it's gonna get much harder once we get to there's one boss that I've always had problems with and a particular boss that will always cause me problems and I don't think this time's gonna be any different I talk big and cocky now, but when we get to this certain one, oh god. Ring the bell, undead church. Hooray. Alright, cool. Cool, cool, cool. This is going pretty well so far, I honestly think. It hasn't been really that much long in time, and we're already this far. I think it's going well. Alright, and now down there. Hey, buddy. Down. There we go. Greetings. Hello. I am Oswald of Kareem, the park. And thou art a friend. For thee, a warm welcome. Cometh thou to confess? Or to accuse? For indeed, all sin is my demand. You. Um. Quest absolution. Oh, right. That's if. Well done. What is it? Well, what is it? Okay. Jester learned. Sweet. Uh, do I want to join this covenant? Um, I think, actually. Why not? I remember this covenant being pretty interesting. I just don't. I don't remember the covenant specifics. Oh, wait. That's right. He's not a covenant himself. He just lets you get rid of him. The poor trespasser invader. You know, I think we might need this stuff, so let's just get it. God damn, I want these souls, but I'm gonna need petrification, purification stones. Pur or purging stones. Oh, I already have a ton of them. Stocking up on indictments. <laughs> the thing is, petrification stones, the thing is, if you don't have those, you're gonna run into some problems because. or er, purifying stones. Because there are enemies that will um, er, apply petrification to you. And if you get petrification, you like lose half your health, I think it is. Like half your total health bar. And it's a nightmare. And there's only a few ways to get rid of it. Pur purging stones is one of them. Puring stones, purgifying stones. I don't remember what they're called now, and I just saw them. But that's one way. There's another way, and I can't remember who else does it. But anyways, that was that. We did it. Look at all these corpses. <laughs> we did it. We got past the bell tower gargoyle, and now we have rung the first bell. Now we gotta ring the second bell, which is in the depths of Blight Town. So, yeah, Blight Town is a bit of a pain, but part of why it was a pain was because of the fr constant frame rate drops. And I think the remastered has fixed has fixed that pretty well, so, well, supposedly, I haven't seen it yet. So, yeah, that will help a lot. <clears throat> Sorry, I just don't shut, I'm not, I just can't shut up playing this game, apparently. Okay, anyways, so now we're back at the Undead Berg. You still waiting? Oh, at Miracles, I presume? Oh yeah, that's Come right, again? I abandoned. Yeah, I don't, I don't care, I don't care, I, I just don't care. All right, back here. Hey, man, I rang the first bell. Why, what a surprise. I didn't expect you to make it. Oh, somebody rang the bell. Wait, was it you? Of course it was. You never give up, do you? I don't know how you do it. Well, don't stop now. Only one more. But it's going to be suicide. <laughs> oh, what do you know, you big old grump? Uh, doesn't Latrec come in here? Wait a second. Where is he at? I'm trying to remember, because Latrec should be here by now. There he is. Be wary of miscreant. Yeah, that's appropriate. Ah, hello there. I have your reward. Sunlight metal. I can't I'm remember what those do. You for freeing me. <laughs> Not enough for you. Well... Let's not be greedy now. But I want to <laughs> be greedy. By the law, <laughs> your humanity. But there are methods. 
Most fools have more humanity than they know what to do with. Now, who do you imagine will make the best use of it? Mm -hmm. I think I'll do just fine. Hanging out by the firekeeper. Is there suspicious motives there? The answer is yes. Yes, there is. Okay, let me see here. Now that I've done that, the direction I should go next. I don't have enough to level up. Do I have any souls I can use? Soul of the Proud Knight. There we go. That should give me enough to level up. You know, you used to have to pop those souls off one at a time, and that was always a big pain. But now, they fixed that, so now you can use multiples, so that's nice. Okay, I've got a plan on what to do next, and we gotta head back this way, because I sh that sh there should be a door that's open now, if I recall. Easiest way to go this way. Because basically you could go to Blighttown, or there's some optional areas you can go to. And you know what? We're going to do pretty much everything, as far as I'm concerned. Mostly everything, anyways. As many bosses as I can. Okay, now it should be... Where? Right, bridge. So the fastest way would be through this area... Okay, we'll get to it. Bear with me here. Press the bonfire. We can reverse hollow real quick. No. Since we got humanity, you can gain him a humanity by either using the item or by um by killing enough enemies and doing other certain things. How many people have checked out my message? Uh, maybe I'll check later. I'll have to make more messages, maybe. Okay. Uh, how, is there a limit to how many messages you can make? I'm not sh I can't remember. Okay, cut through here. Probably gonna get dragon burned. Oh, wait. The fire at least looks a lot, a lot nicer. Ugh, there's one alive. Oh, I wonder what's up with Solaire. Because if I recall, this use ba basement key. Okay, that's open now. That'll lead us to an area. We'll go through there. That's an optional area we can go to, which we will do. Oh, hello there. I will stay behind to gaze at the sun. The sun is a wondrous body, like a magnificent father. If only I could be so grossly incandescent. Oh, hello there. Excuse okay, he's got nothing else to say. Solaire is one of the most interesting characters in Dark Souls, in my opinion, because it's just, it's just the tragedy. That's a story for another time, plus I don't remember the lore off the top of my head right now, because it's been a while, but Solaire is just an interesting character. And, like, he's one of the most beloved characters in the Souls franchise for a reason. I just gotta remember how you get the praise to Sun Emote. I don't remember. I'll have to look it up. Again, there's a lot of stuff. Even I played this game half a dozen ta times through, and I, there's still stuff I don't know or have forgotten or have missed. Okay. So, which way? Okay. So now, up here should be the way to open up a shortcut. There we go. Okay, now that leads us back through here. Okay, this isn't a difficult area. You just gotta watch yourself because there are some annoying things that will kill you pretty quick. Summon signs. I should use those. I should actually just use them, but I want to do things by myself. Are these real character NPCs or are they um, player made characters? I can't remember. I think there's a color distinction from the signs, but I don't remember what they are. Oh. There we 
They're walding torches. Take a drink. There we go. One slice, three kills. Three humanities, that's nice. Okay, now to just be careful. Prisoner ahead. Somebody. Please what? let me out of here. Somebody, help me. Damn, I'm finished. How did this ever happen? It's locked. Okay, that's helpful. I don't remember that. Is there a key I can find? I'll have to check. Huh. Huh. I honestly don't remember that. I don't think I've seen that before. See, that's what I was just saying. There's just stuff. How many times I've beaten the game, I've never seen. Be wary of hollow. They're poisoning me, so I better watch it. Rosalind? Rosalind? Mailbreaker. I'll come back for that door, because I don't remember who's back there. If anybody, or whatever the deal is behind with that. I don't remember that. I don't think I've ever done that. Okay, gotta be careful because through here. Oh, blood loss. Oh, he's got me. He's gonna kill me. I'm not dead yet. Take a drink. Okay, not dead yet. Okay, blood loss. That's right. Okay. I'm, I'm still alive, though. I'm good. Hollow thief tights. Hollow thief tights. Okay. Ah, uh, he's coming behind me. I thought that would work. Okay. Got him. Oh, jeez. A ton of summon signs here. Kind of surprising. So many, and needlessly, needlessly, needlessly so. Alistair. Okay, through here. That frick. Papa demon. Gotta get some breathing room. Okay, the thing is, this boss isn't difficult. Ugh, damn it. Okay, I swear, this isn't a difficult boss. It's his dogs that are actually a real pain. But I just got pinned and I couldn't escape. I swear, that boss isn't difficult. I am stuck and I'm gonna die. Ah, damn it! Oh, and I lost so many souls. I swear this copper demon isn't hard. <laughs> damn it. Oh, shoot. Well, I guess even if I survived, that battery would have died, and then I would have been screwed. Okay, at least I can make an immediate right and be at the boss. The thing about this boss is you gotta take out the dogs, and then the copper demon's pretty simple. God damn it. Damn it. Okay, come on. Okay, you know what? One more time. We are going to beat this goddamn thing. 
This recording doesn't stop until that thing stops moving. <laughs> Try again, try again, come on, this thing is going down. He's charging you before you even got a chance to move. God damn it. You, right when you, before you're in through the fog, I wonder if throwing a fire bomb would help. Nope. Didn't seem to help any specific degrees. Okay, where's the second dog? Did I kill him somehow? On accident? If I can be cheap right back. There we go. God damn, finally. Huh, <sighs> I swear, the copper demon is not a difficult boss, but that was just bullcrap. Did I even get any souls from that? Okay, 6,000. There we go. That's the boost I needed. Ugh, damn it. God, god damn it. Oh, the dog got stuck. That's why. Ugh. You know what? Fine, I'll take it. The thing about Dark Souls bosses, if they get stuck or they get glitched out, I don't feel too bad for them because they screw me around all the time. It's nice to see them get screwed up. Screwed up. Okay, so that's enough. That went on for way too long. <sighs> feel a bit ashamed. The Copper Demon isn't a tough boss, but damn it. That... It's the dogs, really, because they're you gotta worry about them, and then you gotta. I'm not making excuses. I'm not. Okay, I'll call it there and head back to the Firelink Shrine myself. But next time we are gonna get to the depths, which is a pretty interesting area. Optional, but interesting. And hopefully that goes a little bit better than this did. I doubt it though. All right. So until next time, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe and all that. This is Tamara, signing off.